Hello everyone, this is Dhruvajuti and welcome back to Hacksert. And in today's video, we'll be looking at a browser extension in Firefox that can be used to gen uh, find out the meanings of different words out there on the internet. Now, you might be in a scenario wherein you are, let's say, reading through a particular article on the internet and you come across a word which, you know, you don't know the meaning of that particular word and it becomes a tiresome process to copy that particular word and search it onto Google or some other places. But with this extension, it becomes very easy. You can just uh, select the word and you'll get the meaning, all right? So let's begin. So for this open up your Firefox browser and go to the add-ons section all right here you can see add-ons just go over there and this will basically uh, load up the get add-ons page and just scroll down to the bottom here you can see an option that says um, find more add-ons you can find the same option over here you can select any one of the two I'm selecting the one that's in the bottom and this will basically redirect you to the add-on store of Firefox and as you can see, you can find a lot of different types of add-ons in here, the popular ones as well as the most used ones. Here you can search for a particular add-on. So just type in your dictionary, all right? T-I-C-T-I-O-N-A-R-Y. And once you type in the word dictionary, you will see the first, uh, you will see the first suggestion that is Oxford Dictionary, then French Spelling Dictionary. Select the first one that is Oxford Dictionary, all right? And once you select that, this will basically open up. Uh, it will ask you to add the particular extension to your browser. And as you can see, I've already added it to my browser. That's why it's saying remove. Otherwise, you will see the add to Firefox option over here. And you can simply add this particular extension to the Firefox browser. And as you can see that the extension is appearing right over here on the top uh, right hand corner. Now, if you just browse to any particular IT article on the internet, let's say I'm going to more uh, I'm going over to my website and let's say I'll open up this hacking news section and let's say I'll open up this particular article yeah and as you can see that the particular article has opened up and let's say you're reading through the article and suddenly you come across a particular eh, I don't want to see ads and let's say you come across a particular word and you don't know that don't know the meaning of that particular word all right let's say you don't know the meaning of researcher over here so you can just tap on that researcher you can select that particular word and you'll see a blue sky blue colored uh, circle appearing just on top of that and just select that the meaning of the word will appear onto the screen didn't work yeah just select that and as you can see, you will see a small pop-up right in there. And as you can see, the Oxford Dictionary tab will open up. And you can see the meaning of that particular word right in here. You can see the word that is researcher in this case. You can pronounce the word as well. Researcher. It will basically give you a British or, yeah, British pronunciation. And you can see a person who carries out academic or scientific research, a medical researcher who pioneered the development of antibiotics a person whose job involves discovering or verifying information for use in a book program etc all right so you can use this particular extension in this way let's take an, an, an let's take another example let's say for example you don't know the meaning of universal and you just uh, select that particular thing and let it up appear as you can see the word universal and universal you can see the pronunciation has also come up there are two meanings to this particular word and as you can see the the first one is given over here and the next one should be at the bottom yeah the next one as you can see a u.s film production company formed in 1912 and i don't need to give introduction about this particular film industry or film production company and you can see the particular english word universal means relating to or done by all the people or things in the world or in a particular group applicable to all cases all right so you can uh, let's take another example for example let's take uh, which one should i take let's see if any brand name comes up microsoft 
let's see if this comes up uh, no exact match for microsoft this is basically a brand name so sometimes if you search the meaning of brand names you may not get uh, the meaning of that particular word all right but you can see some suggestions like micro don't micro dot or what is this micro sum and let's say let's take another example for example let's say what is the meaning of website so you can see the word website has appeared in here and if you website website I'm kind of good in British pronunciation as well all right so you can see the meaning right in here and some examples as well so in this way you can use this particular extension and the, let's see this one hacker so you'll get the true definition of a hacker not the ones manipulated by media a person who uses computers to gain unauthorized access to data which is kinda okay or informal and enthusiastic or skillful computer programmer or user this is the actual meaning of a hacker all right the first one that you see over here is a mini, uh, media manipulated definition i should say but the second one that you see over here informal one is actually the true meaning of a hacker an enthusiastic or skillful computer programmer or user all right a person who has a lot of computer skills or, or who has sound knowledge about computers and networks all right that is the actual meaning of a hacker not the one who actually gains unauthorized access to systems which is kind of the most common uh, meaning or definition of a hacker but that's not the actual definition this is the one all right an enthusiastic or skillful pro computer programmer or user all right so that's it for this video i hope you found this extension to be a little bit useful i actually found it a few days ago i was uh, reading through an article on the internet it was not related to cyber security or inter uh, computers it was uh, i think a political based article or something i was reading it was a gk based article right i was reading that particular article and it used so many you know tough words in there and i was pre i was f almost freaked out every time i saw so many new words right in there so i was just searching onto the uh, add-on section as to is there any new add-on or any type of a good add-on that can simplify the meaning searching process and I came across this particular Oxford Dictionary extension uh, unfortunately the official extension is not available in Google Chrome it's only available in Firefox I mean it's available in Google Chrome but in Google Chrome what you need to do is specifically select the word and right click and here you can see look up in Ox Oxford Dictionary this will basically if you click this option this will basically redirect you to the oxford dictionary website and therein you can see the uh, get the meaning but in case of firefox you can get this you can take advantage of this particular pop-up to actually know the meaning of the word so that's another advantage of using firefox over chrome all right so i found this particular extension and then i started using it and I found it pretty good, all right. And then thought that maybe other people will find it very useful as because I didn't find such videos onto the internet. All right, so that's it for this video, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace.